Hello, I'm Bradley, and welcome to my channel. First things first, if you're new here, please subscribe. You don't have to, of course, but it would really help me out to where I'm trying to get my channel to be. Okay, so here's one for you. So, never assume your hairdresser or the person who's cutting your hair, your barber, whatever, <laughs> never assume that they know exactly what's in your head, what you're thinking, for your haircut. Okay, here goes. This, I know, looks incredibly short. It all started Friday. We're now on Sunday. It all started on Friday. And this has grown a little bit. So I'm walking through my local town centre. OK, not feeling particularly amazing. I've had a little bit of vertigo last week um, and I'm walking through the town centre. I've just gone for a lovely lunch with my mum. I've just got a promotion at work. So amazing. Really, really overjoyed. My mum treated me to an amazing lunch. We had that. And I thought I really want my sides smartened up because they were really grown out i've got longer hair okay done up in like a top knot here um i want my side smartened for when wednesday comes along this coming week for me to go in and have a really nice sleek on point look um so we've had this really nice i've, I've not noticed it so i haven't been to my local town center for a couple of weeks and they've clearly just had the most amazing absolutely amazing uh barbers come hairdressers fitted and it is absolutely stunning i think it's pr primarily uh men um uh, aimed at and they've got the most amazing kind of retro barber chairs the whole place is fitted out incredible really really looks amazing to be quite honest with you almost like you've gone back in time so i thought to myself i looked and i thought oh I might think about having my sides cut now. Anyway, I was going about what I was doing, went in a few shops with mum and one thing or another, and I thought, you know what, I'm going to just do it. Because I've also tried to have my, my sides cut with the uh, the person who usually cuts my hair. And this hairdresser I've been going to for, well, I'm 29 now, and I've been going there since I was about 16, may even be earlier than that. And it's a collection of people, about three Maybe four people who have been cutting my hair throughout that time. Um, but it's always just been the, that group of people. So I thought, oh, I was a bit disappointed that I couldn't get in and have my hair cut. So I thought, OK, do you know what? I've just spotted this amazing place. I'm going to go for it. Yeah. Amazing place. The guy who cut my hair, absolutely amazing what he done. And the issue is not him. It is purely me. And that is why I tell you, OK, never, ever assume that the person cutting your hair knows what's in your head, okay, and you just go along with it. This is where it happens. <laughs> this is where it all fell apart. So I want the size of my hair cut. I said very clearly, I didn't want the length of my hair touched. All right, didn't want the length of my hair touched. Fine, no problem. I've got a bit of hair related issues going on in the front hair at the moment. I'm able to disguise that. My hair is to my shoulders at the moment. Just touching my shoulders just passed. It's fine, but I've got quite a lot of it. Um, one to the sides then usually have a zero okay then up to a one okay and then the highest up to a two and then i have it faded throughout i call that a bold fade not though is it it's not <laughs> i said if i could have a bold fade right and here we go so when the guy starts doing it okay and i think he's from his english was good okay he was from he was kurdish okay so had all this nice rapport going on really really great really lovely place he looked really really cool he was doing an amazing job and then i seen how high he took the first point of the razor up here and i thought straight away i thought that's going to be really difficult to fade i thought perhaps he's going to fade it out this way i've never seen it before gave him the benefit of the doubt he was there smiling chatting along he done the next and as he started working back to sort of my ear here it was all bold and i was like um oh but you know what? i didn't question that but i didn't say that's not what i asked for i didn't start causing an issue or anything like that at all i simply just accepted that for a long time i was gonna have just skin here and you know what it is really nice i'm not going to show you the back but you can kind of see there is not much here at all it is just skin down here and here it really is and when i had this done friday there was nothing you could literally see it was like this here he had done a bold shave okay bold so i had my long length on top amazing not touched thankfully however 
I do think he nicked a few areas, because when I took it down, there were some long hairs in there, I thought, great. However, I can get over that, because I've got quite a bit of hair anyway. Fine hair. It's finer here, because I'm having some sort of loss of one thing and another at the moment, around stress, seasonal loss, what have you. I'm using a bunch of products, which is going really, really well. Um, so I'm okay with that at the moment. But this, yeah, I like it short, but I like it zero to one to two. I like that fade. But of course, it's on me, because I said a bold fade. Zero fade. I think, to be honest, he thought I said shave, and all of it was just gone. There's no fade, there's no definition, there's no different grading, it's just zero. Boom. As you can see, right up to here, all the way around, it's a zero. And I'm just really pleased that I don't have it up here. Because I know a lot of people who have these long hair top knot styles, like me, do it from up here. They don't have that side bit. My twin brother, in fact, hates that side bit. When we do that style on him, because I cut his hair. But, <laughs> yeah, so I've got the zero up to here. So, never ever assume that the person cutting your hair knows. Of course, if you've been seeing that person for many, many years, like my normal hairdresser, right, then she is amazing. I don't even have to say. She just does it. And it's done amazing each time. But this time, I couldn't get in with her. So, of course, I've seen this great place. And, you know, I... I would recommend that place. I would recommend that place. I would go there again. The guy was really good at what he done. It was just me almost kind of thinking that, I suppose, because of what I've been sort of just like the lady who cuts my hair for a long, long time now, or the collective group of people cut my hair every now and again. Like, for example, when the lady usually cuts my hair on, on a holiday or anything like that, and somebody else steps in and he's really, really good. And I don't even have to say, and they know how I like my hair. Whereas I went to a new person, of course, stupidly, I had that mindset that this person would just know by me saying the terms which I've been using for my place, which I normally go to. Yeah, no, it didn't work out like that. So I may as well as have just wet shaved all of this myself because it's gone. But hair grows really, really quickly, doesn't it? It does. Anyway, I've got a, I've got a meeting which I need to be in the office on Wednesday. I've got a new job, my first day at my new job tomorrow. So I'm really, really looking forward to that. Um, and I wanted a smart, short hairstyle at the sides of my long hairstyle on top. And yeah, I got that, didn't I? I got that. <laughs> so please, please, please never assume that the person cutting your hair knows. Okay. So, I've made a bit of a slip up. I don't think it's an error, though. I don't think, well, it is a bit of an error on my half, but there's nothing against him at all, because he done a really, really good cut. In fact, he was even using this special shavy thing at the bottom, which really took it down to the skin. But you know what? It's a new style on me. It's, it's not a new style, but it's a new look on me. I've never had it this short at all before. Um, it's different. Would I have it again? No. Can't wait for it to grow back. So that nice fade, which I like. But um, I'm just so pleased I didn't have the top cut like that because, wow, if I just said a little bit, you never know what would have happened because I was just in that, sort of in that zone thinking, this person's going to know. And of course, he's only just met me. How on earth would he have known? So, so, yeah, never, ever presume the person who's cutting your hair, even if they've been cutting your hair for years, never presume that they have got your image of what you want your hair to be like in their head. Make it very, very clear. It's all on you. All right, not them. Okay, so thank you very, very much for joining me on this clip. Thank you. I hope you like this this new kind of look. I will be letting it grow through. Let me know what you think. Leave me a comment down below if you have any questions at all. Please leave them down below. I do my utmost to get back to you as quickly as I can. Thanks very much for being here. And until next time, I will be seeing you real soon. God bless and take great care. Bye for now. Thanks very much.